We have the latest updates from the IRS.gov. The IRS will be incorporating new AI technology to answer your questions in regards to different notices that you will receive. We will cover sample notices, so make sure you stay tuned, as well as the numbers has updated for your delayed 2023 tax refunds and much, much more. Welcome back, everyone. So happy to have you back for another update. The IRS announced today that they will expand their chat bot technology to help answer your questions quickly regarding different notices that are being mailed. Notices like CP2000, CP2501, CP32198. Now, the income or payment information the IRS received from third parties such as employers or financial institution does not match the information you reported on your tax return. That is CP2000 notice. CP2501 notice, the income or payment information reported to the IRS does not match the information you reported on your tax return and CP3219A, that the IRS received information that is different from what you reported on your tax return. Now, you will be able to, to get answers using the IRS chatbot future. This will help you get answers regarding notices much quicker so that the IRS can free up more personnel to handle more complex issues like cutting down these backlog refunds. The IRS is reporting that since January 2022, their uh, voice and chat bots, uh, both in English and Spanish, has helped more than 13 million taxpayers avoid wait times by resolving different tax issues, including setting up roughly 151 million in payment arrangements. The chatbot uh, chat future stimulates human interaction with you, the taxpayer, through a web, mobile app, or on a computer screen by responding to questions or requests in the chat future. Also, at the end of your conversation, you will always have the option to press representative to speak to a live person. So that is a plus. Now, again, the chat bot will be available to help taxpayers with uh, questions such as what, why you receive a particular notice, what do you need to do, or what is the time frame for that notice is, as well as how to find uh, if the IRS received your responses as well. That will be uh, something that you can search using the chatbot future. Now, in terms of your delayed 2023 tax refunds, currently the IRS is stating they have reduced that number to 945000 900,000 are returns requiring correction and 45,000 are paper returns waiting to be processed. Check out the last tax refund update where the numbers were slightly higher. So the IRS is decreasing your backlog. In terms of the amended tax returns, the late amended tax returns are now at 894,000 process on process forms 1040X. The IRS is reporting it is taking them 20 weeks or more to complete your delayed amended tax returns. Now, in terms of victims of identity theft, if you sent form 14039 to the IRS, the IRS is reporting they are behind on processing those forms. On an average, it is taking them about 480 days to resolve identity theft cases. So make sure you are checking for any updates, but be aware that they are behind on completing those forms, as well as if you requested an individual taxpayer identification number, 
the IRS is currently processing Forms W-7 application for individual taxpayer identification number that they received in August. So they are currently working on those received in August of 2023. It states that they are processing the request in order they receive them. Remember, if you are still waiting, you have been under review for more than 120 days, contact the Taxpayer Advocate Service for assistance at 1-877-777-4778 and check out the previous uh, video where I went over in detail some of the reasons why your tax return may be under review. It will be pinned in the comment section as well as in the description box. And don't forget to share your comments, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates.